Well, you're watching the final of the Dartford Conservative Club Open held in mid-March. And firstly, a massive thanks to the organisers for letting me film. Uh, it's been a fantastic day's darts, it has to be said. And the organisers are Kayleigh Brookshaw, Calvin Brookshaw, uh, Beardy Brookshaw, that's uh, Brian Brookshaw, and Penny Brookshaw. Uh, Penny uh, did all the food. Um, absolutely brilliant food, let me tell you. And uh, a massive thanks as well to the chairman of the club, Darren Riley, as well. Just uh, fantastic stuff from all of them. It's the first Open that they've done uh, as a combined team. And it's been a great day's darts. And these are great darts from Pilgrim to kick us off in this final. First to five legs. And uh, as I say, 36 competitors. We did a round robin uh, today. Six boards of six players per group. And uh, from that, that formed the last 16 uh, for the knockout aspect of this. Four perfect darts from Pilgrim to kick us off in this final. Not a bad way to get things underway here. And uh, Paul Holloway should deserves a shout out as well, really, who's uh, the other contestant in this final, um, because Holloway was helping uh, throughout the day with uh, his knowledge and advice for uh, the organisers as well. So uh, deserves a lot of credit for that. But it's always Great to see uh, new events like this popping up um, around the local area. And a uh, massive thanks to Team Brookshaw for their fantastic efforts. And hopefully the first of uh, many at what is a, a really lovely venue. And two very talented players to contest this final. Now Pilgrim will be familiar to many of you, I'm sure. The answer to many a quiz question, such as who topped the averages on the Pro Tour in 2022 and who topped the averages in the Challenge Tour in 2022. That was on, went for the double-double route. But plenty of time here for Pilgrim and a leg which he started second in. Holloway won the bullseye, hasn't quite found his scoring just yet. We Desperately hoping to leave a finish after this visit, just to apply some kind of pressure. 25, you feel. Can't be found, so plenty of time on Pilgrim's side here to find double 18, and he does so. So 16 darts to kick us off in this contest. Pilgrim's head very busy few weeks it has to be said uh, despite uh, just falling short of winning a tour card in Q school we flew through the first stage it has to be said of uh, Q school and then just ran into for want of a better word weapons and uh, at the second stage but uh, it certainly Performed well on the Challenge Tour, came through Riley's qualifier to reach the UK Open. You can see that final. That was against Darryl, uh, against Jason Askew, rather. Better darts there from Holloway as he looks to get a foothold in this contest. He's beat Jason Askew, good friend, and they had a replay of that match in the semi-final of this tournament. Absolutely ludicrous contest. It was 4-2 in the end. Pilgrim averaged over 100. Averaged 105, in fact, to Askew's 97. So uh, it will always be one of my life's regrets that I didn't capture that one. A nice 140 there from Pilgrim gets them down to a finish first. And this is filmed just the week after the UK Open and before the next batch of challenge tours. So precious match practice for the Surrey County A player. 
and a, a good recovery with his third dart. And Holloway will be on a finish after this. So a bit of pressure on this 62 in a leg which Pilgrim started first in. Single 12 or 20 leaves double 16. So a chance to break straight back here for Holloway. One treble needed in this combination. Finds it with his first dart. Single 16 leaves a chance at tops. You can see his frustration there. Pulled it. Maybe just a bit of pressure. So double eight. Is that an awkward marker? No, it's a good marker. 20 data follows up the 16. And Pilgrim does hold his throw. Holloway's route to the final beat Mick Ford and James Sayer in the uh, last 16 and last 8. And then came through a very tough contest against Michael Barnard, of course, the former Challenge Tour winner and BDC tour card holder and world championship participant. <laughs> Holloway, talented player himself, has done a lot of the PDC uh, stuff before. Q score in 2022 and quite a lot of the challenge tour tournaments before that. Didn't go to Q school this year. Still a very dangerous player and has done the uh, Modus Super Series as well. Good recovery with his third dart there. Pilgrim though is applying the pressure again in a leg which he threw second in. And has essentially stolen the throw here. Now has a 100 point advantage. I'd like to give a shout out to those that were in my knockout group actually, or not knockout group rather, the round robin route group. Really very nice crowd indeed. Paul Lowing, Tyron Wayne, Toby Rowe, Joel Allen and Dan Birmingham. Hello if you're watching. A really lovely group of players and what has been uh, a really lovely day it has to be said. Pilgrim down to a two dark combination chance to break again will he go the double double route so he can't find the double 18 but leaves him, it's a sensible route to go isn't it leaves himself tops after 15 the 156 won't go from Holloway so Holloway is down to a two dark to if this doesn't go but it does go clinical has to be said 17 data and another break of throw Pilgrim are used to this sort of format best of nine of course is what they play on the challenge tour they play best of seven in the Moda Super Series he's set to take part in that at the end of April I think he's doing the full week so Watch out for him there. Nice start for Holloway. And uh, played in the UK Open for the third time. That was seven days before this was filmed, approximately. Lost out to Lewis Gurney, averaging 102. Just, <laughs> just uh, really fantastic darts but uh, just hasn't quite had the rub of the green, it has to be said. Maybe his luck will change as he heads to Germany for the next set of challenge tours. Pilgrim's route to the final also beat Paul Wells and Lee Mills in the knockout phase of this competition. For that uh, semi-final against good friend Jason Askew. Ton here would be nice. Ton 40 even better. Pilgrim down to a finish first. 
Although I need a big one himself. Can't find it. So a nice ton, but it's not quite enough. Six starts from one to four for Pilgrim. Doesn't have to go the treble 18 route. Does go that way. Alright, we'll apply some pressure here. Another treble would do very nicely. That's unfortunate. That looked to be heading in the direction of the treble 20. Needs 118 if the 68 doesn't go. The, just on the wire of the double 18 so one trouble needed and Holloway finds it so single 18 this is similar to earlier takes his time the tops well that's a much better effort looks to the sky because that was close that was very close but, uh, Pilgrim comes back nails double 18 at the first time of asking a 19 data there Four legs so far have been 16, 20, 17 and 19. And Holloway, well, you can throw caution to the wind here now. Those that he has to win. Five straight legs in order to take the title here, but... We see it time and again, don't we, when uh, darts players... Backs against the wall. They can often produce their best stuff. Do consider subscribing while you're here. Lots of uh, content for various tournaments. And that is a lovely maximum there from Pilgrim found just at the right time. And this is a good response from Holloway. Can you follow it with a max? He was looking to just stack that dart on the on the other two. Certainly reminds Pilgrim that he's still there though. Needs a single twenty at least to leave the big fish. Holloway will be down to finish himself. And a very handy one as well. So there is pressure on Pilgrim. Oh, he needs another one. That would have been nice, wouldn't it? Still haven't seen one on this channel. I'm determined to film a 170 checkout at some point. So Holloway to save his skin. And uh, well, he does go the 19's route. So he wants double 19. Well, that is the risk. And uh, you can see the frustration there. Leaves, double eight. If the 65 doesn't go, the finishing from Down has been very good in this contest. He's hit a bullseye. That's Sod's Law. Double four then for the title. And he does get there. He gets there. 15 data to close things out. And Dale Pilgrim lifts the title here at the Dartford Conservative Club Open. Congratulations to Dale. Commiserations to Paul. And I'll hand you over to the presentations. Your 
champion, Mr. Darrell Pilgrim, everybody. Thank you very much, guys.